But this person still feels passion here with the Knight of Rods. This is known as the player. So you might be dealing with someone who's a player here, but um, they're still looking at you. They're still thinking about you um, and they still feel attraction to you. Like um, even though they would like to, you know, they would love to just let you go and, you know, to turn their back on you. Um, I feel like this person might be spiteful. Um, and like I said, I do sense they have an ego here. So they would love to turn their back on you, but I feel like they can't with the Eight of Swords because they still feel a strong attraction to you. Um, and, uh, yeah, and they can't, they can't stop thinking about you and they can't help wanting to be with you. So with the Hermit up right here, I feel like they are, um, they're thinking about what to do, you know? They're trying to, they're making a plan. They're strategizing, okay? Um, they're trying to, to reconnect with you. They want to reconnect with you and they're, they're coming up with a plan or a strategy, um, to win you back, you know, and to, to get close to you again. All right. That's what I see, Sagittarius. So I'm keeping the, I'm keeping these readings short. So if that resonated, please give me a thumbs up. I'd appreciate that. And let's move on to Capricorn. All right, Capricorn, what are your person's current feelings for you in the next 24 hours, Capricorn? Spirit, please show me what are this person's current feelings for Capricorn in the next 24 hours. Let me know when we're ready. You ready now? Okay. All right, let's get started, Capricorn. First card for you is the Wheel of Fortune in the reverse. What else? The Fool Upright. What else? The King of Rods Upright. All right, and the last card is the Six of Cups Upright. All right, let me take a look here, Capricorn. Capricorn, I feel like this person wants to reconnect with you here. Um, their Wheel of Fortune, they want things to change. They want things to change from whatever has been going on between you two um, to something new here. They want a new beginning with the Fool card. Um, with the Six of Cups, they still have feelings for you. They still feel, they feel a strong connection to you this can be a feeling feeling like you are their soulmate feeling like you are their twin flame feeling like you are someone that they've known all their life like they feel very comfortable with you they can talk to you about any about anything you know um and it's almost like a friend type of energy a friendly like you two can be best friends as well as well as lovers you know King of Rods, there's a lot of passion here. Um, I, I get this. I get the feeling that this person is just waiting for you, Capricorn. You know. Yeah, they're not taking any action towards you. They're waiting for you that for you to come on your own to them. And I think this person feels like you are going to come to them eventually. You know. They don't know when, but they know like eventually Capricorn is gonna come back to me. They're gonna they're gonna um, message me or um, reach out to me, um, and they're they're waiting for that because they do want a new beginning with you, and they are very much interested in you, um, and they feel passion for you, and um, yeah, they can't help feeling like you are their soulmate. Okay. All right, so Capricorn that. That was your short reading. 
um, give me a thumbs up if it resonated. And we are moving on to Aquarius. Aquarius, what are your person's current feelings for you in the next 24 hours? Four of Pentacles just flew out of the deck here. Let's get three more cards. Three more cards for Aquarius, please. What are this person's current feelings for Aquarius in the next 24 hours? Knight of Rods in the reverse. Actually, we'll just keep that on to the side. I'm going to pick four cards here. Page of Pentacles in the reverse. What else? The Devil in the reverse. The Page of Rods upright. Alright, let me just take a look here. Aquarius, this person's current feelings for you in the next 24 hours. I feel like this person, Aquarius, they want to release whatever has happened to you in the past. Whatever has happened between you two in the past. It's like they want to release it. They want to let it go. They want to forget about it. Um, yeah, with the devil in reverse, it's like let's let's forget whatever it is that happened between us. And, you know, let's let's start again. And with the page of rods, I feel like this person... They want to start a, a line of conversation with you. They want to start communicating with you again. But it's like, let's not talk about the same topics, you know. Let's not take, talk about the same subjects as we always do. Let's talk about something different. Let's, let's turn the leaf, you know. Yeah, let's try and be friends again at least, you know. I feel like this person wants to be friends with you. <clears throat> yeah, they want to reestablish here some sort of stability here with you. In some sort of stability in this relationship. They want to reestablish that. Um, with the Page of Pentacles in the reverse, I feel like... Um, maybe somebody owes someone an apology. I don't know if it's this person or you, um, this person to you or you to them, but it's like, I feel like this person is saying, let's just forget about that, you know, let's not think about that and let's just, you know, um, let the past be in the past and let's talk about something different here and let's try and be friends, okay? All right, so that was a specific message, um, Aquarius, so if that resonated with you, please give me a thumbs up, I'd really appreciate it, and let's move on to Pisces. All right, Pisces, what are your person's current feelings for you in the next 24 hours, Pisces? One more shuffle. Alright, Spirit, what are this person's current feelings for Pisces in the next 24 hours? Thank you. First card, Pisces, is the Knight of Swords in the reverse. What else? We also have the Tower upright. Oh, my God. What else? <laughs> you, had the, you had the Tower yesterday, Pisces, and here it is again. What else? The star upright. Well, that's good. That's a change from yesterday's reading. What else? 
and the six of cups in the reverse all right well at least there's a little bit more positive energy here in this reading than yesterday if you if you watched yesterday's reading you would have seen it was very negative it was very um tragic yeah, i would say now in terms of this person's current feelings for you in the next 24 hours um They realize that something really dramatic, very um, tragic or intense happened to, between you two with the Tower card. Um, they realize that a lot of damage was done. But with the Star card, I feel like this person is praying or wishing or hoping that things will heal between you two. Okay? Especially with the five, I say five, this is six of cups in the reverse, but it goes back to the five of cups upright, which is a card of grieving, grieving a, a loss, an emotional loss, um, feeling sad, feeling depressed. So I feel like this person um, is praying and hoping that you two can heal whatever it is, um, whatever it is that happened between you two that created a lot of damage here in this connection i don't feel like they are talking to you with the knight of swords in the reverse i feel like they are keeping quiet this can be someone who's like giving you the silent treatment here but you know inside of them they are praying here and hoping for for a change um or not for change for healing like i said Yeah, but like I said, I feel like with the Knight of Swords, this person is, you know, turning their back here. Um, they don't want to, um, they don't feel ready to talk or they don't feel ready to communicate. Um, and it's almost like they're trying to process whatever it is that happened. They're trying to process all the events that have happened between you two. Um, they are also grieving here and they are broken hearted but they are hopeful that things can heal between you two and that um, yeah and that this relationship in some way can be repaired okay eventually right I don't think right now because it does look very fresh but like eventually that things can repair be repaired and heal all right so that's your reading, Pisces. So if that resonated, please give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. And yeah, that was the last sign. So I did all the signs, Aries, from Aries to Pisces. So I'm, I'm going to end the video here. Thank you, everyone, for watching. I appreciate every single one of you. And I appreciate all your um, comments and your thumbs up and your subscriptions. Um, and I really wish you all the best, okay? Sending you all my love and um, sending you good energy, good vibrations, and good light. All right, bye. Bye, guys.